a place of serene beauty and contemplation. A desert isle covered in parasol mushroom trees, with a flowing stream, land to farm, seas to fish from, and views to admire. At this island of tranquility is truly a paradise of rustic living, home to an exiled priest, a servant of the tribunal temple, living alone with a view of that great city. But uh, there's more here than meets the eye. There's secret sun cover, a quest to go on, a journey of truth and discovery to pursue. For today's Mother the Day is Galen's Quest for Truth by Kaya Carell and Danae. At this, at this is a just an exquisitely breathtakingly beautiful quest and landscape mod that overhauls one of the many sandbar islands of the Norvain Bay. Uh, the meat of the content here is a series of new quests involving a strange hermit that you'll find residing on this little spar of land. An exiled priest, formerly of the Temple of Avak. As you get to know him, uh, you'll learn his story, doing a few odd quests, fetching items you might need, and eventually uncovering the details of his fraught escape from the clutches of overzealous ordinators. At designed to intertwine with the Morrowind's main quest, uh, you can help Galen's quest for the truth, to discover what the Tribunal Temple is really hiding, the origins of the so-called Divine Disease, the Blight, and help him learn more about the dissident priests. Uh, this starts out as uh, simply enough, you know, just helping them get some equipment and samples to study the Blight, and uh, then, eventually, escorting him to Telfir. Uh, there's, uh, there's a few branching choices here, and uh, quite a bit of writing, uh, you know, to make Galen feel like a truly fleshed out character that you'll enjoy meeting again and again as you progress through the main quest. But unquestionably, the most eye-catching element of this mod, you know, beyond the new quest, is uh, Galen's scenic little isle. Uh, for it is just uh, truly a, a true atmospheric delight, just covered with detailed cozy almonds. The hallmark of Kaya Carell's superb craft for beautifully designed locations. Uh, the environment here is just, is just utterly gorgeous. From Galen's tent, uh, which is not only just wonderfully detailed and furnished, but also updates over time as you complete his quest to the nearby dock and shipwreck, just teeming with underwater life. At the little fire pit with a view of the inner sea and the far off shores of the tarry built mainland, uh, to the peaceful little inland pool and stream with a place for meditation, uh, to the charming little wooded grove with a truly mesmerizing view of the Vivac city skyline. Uh, this, uh, this is the sort of place you'd want to visit just to, you know, sit back and relax. And indeed, uh, if you have Ashfall, uh, this is a perfect place to set up camp, with plenty of room for you to build your own campsite, uh, water sources for you to use, food for you to harvest, and uh, plenty of fishing spots to use with ultimate fishing. It is, uh, it is truly just an Isle of Dreams, a place to get lost in the tranquility of nature and the game world around you. Combined with an honestly intriguing questline that works to enhance the main quest and a new adventure for you to go on, uh, this, uh, this is another fantastic quest mod from the 2023 Modathon, and uh, one I, I really think you should check out, you know, if you haven't already. And uh, just as a note, I, I, I have to say, I, I just, I really love how we've gotten so many mods recently that overhaul islands in the Norvain Bay. Uh, just last year, we got the Pearl Divers, which overhauls an island just to the south of this one, and also Ob Shipwrecks, uh, which overhauls a little sandbar just to the north. And uh, combined, you know, you get a, just a few really interesting locations just around Vivek. But uh, that's just uh, that's just our mod of the day. So, uh, as always, uh, I've been your host, our golf guy. Uh, thanks for watching. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Happy morning, and I'll just, I'll uh, see you all next time.